The closed claim orthopedic study that was done by the doctor's company really provided excellent insight into the importance of patient miscommunication and patient behavior and how those things can fuel over one-third of all of their malpractice claims. As a result of the study, we saw three key areas where we could influence change. The first was in trying to improve doctor-patient communication. The second was in improving the office patient communication relative to financial responsibility. And the third was improving patient selection and patient selection process for surgery. In trying to improve patient-doctor communications, we decided that today people communicate in different ways and we elected to add a patient engagement application that could be used on a mobile phone to try to communicate in new and more efficient ways with the patients both preoperatively and postoperatively. In the area of office patient communications, we enhanced our ability for the patient to work directly with a financial advisor in our office so that the patient understands preoperatively what his financial responsibility is relative to the surgical bill. In addition, we now have the patients speak directly with a financial advisor at the surgery center so they also understand their financial responsibility for the facility charge and the anesthesia charge. And lastly, it is still the doctor's important financial discussion to remind the patient of the fact that they may very well need post-operative physical therapy for many of the procedures that we perform. And if they cannot afford that type of therapy, then clearly it may affect their outcome. Looking at patient selection, we elected to improve this process by engaging also our anesthesiologist in our outpatient surgery center. Together, we developed a preoperative screening assessment that is done prior to surgery so that we can identify comorbidities in our patients and therefore enhance patient selection and decrease risk of complication postoperatively. And by doing this, we lower complication, improve outcome, and lower risk.